At the link in the video description, I have lots of examples of bad calls made over the years in pro pool matches. In this video, I focus on two recent calls made concerning unintentional miscue scoop shots. Here are the two shots, both of which were called fouls. Foul. Do you think the refs made the right calls in these situations? Foul. These were both matchroom pool events being played under the WPA official International Rules of Pool. Foul. Here's an excerpt from my recent Jump Shot Physics video that explains the pertinent rules and gives another example. Venom is attempting to jump the cue ball over an obstacle ball, but unintentionally scoops under the cue ball. Is this shot a foul? Here are the pertinent official WPA rules covering this type of shot. Rule 818 indicates that a scoop shot is treated just like a miscue. And Rule 617 indicates that it is an unsportsmanlike conduct foul to intentionally miscue or scoop. Otherwise, a miscue or scoop is not a foul. The main purpose for the scoop rule is to prevent shots like this, where there is clear intent to illegally scoop under the cue ball to easily clear an obstacle ball. So, is this shot a foul? The intent was to legally jump over the obstacle ball, but the tip was unintentionally lowered during the stroke, causing a miscue scoop. But a miscue is not a foul unless it is intentional. One could rule that the scoop was not intentional and is therefore not a foul, as with any unintentional miscue. However, one could also rule that the miscue is what enabled the jump with an illegal scoop. This is something that probably needs to be clarified in the rules, because the correct call is not obvious. For example, maybe a statement like this should be added. Any jump shot involving a scoop or a miscue is a foul. Again, under the current WPA rules, a miscue scoop is not a foul unless it is intentional in an attempt to jump over a ball. So were the correct calls made in the two pro-match shots shown earlier? The intent was totally obvious in both situations. Each player was clearly attempting to pocket the ball with backspin to draw back for shape on the next shot. So the miscue scoop was obviously unintentional in both examples. Therefore, the calls were incorrect. The cue ball made contact with the object ball, and there was cushion contact after the hit, so each shot was legal. The shots did not accomplish what was intended, but they should not have been penalized as fouls, giving ball in hand to the opponents. Pelovanovic obviously suspected the call was wrong and questioned it. Foul. Is it? Yeah, because you jumped it over. You, you kind of like, because of the miscue, you jumped over the ball. That's a foul shot. Consider the foul shot. Sure. Yes. I would have had the same or a stronger reaction. The call was not correct under the WPA official International Rules of Pool. Hopefully, future matchroom pool events will more closely follow the WPA rules. And hopefully, the WPA will consider modifying the rules for miscues and scoop shots so it will be clearer how to make the correct calls in different situations, especially when player intent is not obvious. If you want to learn more about pool rules and fouls and see more examples, visit the links in the video description. Good luck with your game from Dr. Dave. Thank you.